There it is. Looks like Dr. Bacon left abruptly again after finishing his explanation. In any case, these diving gloves looks like they could come in very handy. I heard I see people are waiting for you. Go down there and try to pull the safe. Uh, we can try to sell some stuff. Wait, I have to upgrade to here. I dive. Get this diving suit. Get more cargo, I guess. Now let's let's get a carpoon. There. And just extra air tank. Now I have 200 health. Nice. Time to go. Alright, let's see how it goes. Also, I have a net now. Why at all? Do I have a net? Only have a I know. Never mind. Let's see what this is. Ah, a <laughs> net gun. Uh no. Still one more hush start. Thank you very much. I hope I don't get lost. Remo, you're far away. Here it is. Can I go down through here? Nope. I guess I'll cut and I'll to the depth. So I'll BRB right here. I only have harsh start on me. Easy. He does it. We are the shot. 
here it is. Here's the blue hole. Yep, the extra O2 for safety. What to get you? There it is. that way you have to go to here or no keep catching little critters Just got in. <laughs> Octopus return. is clear. Just wait, you octopus. Hey, how dare you spray ink twice? I won't let you get away with this. That's Bancho for Takoyaki. Oh, he can't run. Maybe he can. I uh, ran away again. It's definitely quick. Drop something again. They always leave something behind. It might not be as bad as I thought. Pick this up. I don't know what this is. Seems to be an artifact. I have to identify it back at the surface. Thank you, Octopus! I don't know what this does though. Oh yeah, this is where the quest is. Let's remove that stake. First, something here. Also, today's the last day of Jellyfish Party. I don't know how it works. Don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. Don't kill me. You have to sleep in here? Oh! Oh! Ran out of juice! Not great! Shovels better damage. Now let's go. I need to be quick. Got it. Get myself some O2. back human I was afraid you'll be eaten by a frill shark on the way back mm. looks like someone I don't know. 
I think I'll be able to pull that mistake if I use the diving gloves from Dr. Bacon, who lives on land. Bacon. In a hard language, that name sounds like spoiled whale meat. Uh, okay. Wait a moment, let me try and pull. Ready, set, pull. Run. Run. It didn't work. It was effective, but not enough. I think one more attempt might cut it. Human, there's another rock pile over there. Hmm. Huh, there's no movable device over there. I'll have to go and check it out first. Huh? Well, this one I need to catch five. Okay, I only have two. Okay, how to get up here? There's nothing that's been done on this side. I have to try going around the back. Where is it though? Oh, jelly, jelly, jellyfish, jellyfish. And there's like a shark over there. I'll tie one. Okay, so it can't be eight. Oh, I wasted. Let's catch this guy. Got him. Pookie cut the shot. Oh, it's only one star. Does I kill it? Let's recash these. Jellyfish. Oh, there's more ammo though. Because there's a bomb guy over there. Can you give me a hard start? Tranquilizer. Okay, cool. Better. The level three. Too far, Dave. Yeah. It's a chance, Dave. Heavy. Wait, rock is right here. Oh no way. Ooh. I thought I'm gonna get blown up. Oh no, I think I'm slower now. Looks like I need to be faster. Oh no, there's another one. Ouch! I didn't see you! There's a snake in the back, if I pull that out. Okay, but first, I need to lighten the load. Yeah, get rid of this cookie cutter shot. should be okay. Yeah, for that. Ready, set, pull.
There it is. Go down, please. Human, good. We have a bag. The more useful than you look. The village is very close. Follow me through the hole you just made. I'll go ahead. Wait, I can leave now, can't I? Would you listen to yourself? Aren't you worried for Ramo? Besides, I have a request for you, so I would like you to come to the village with us. The Sea People Village? Me? Yes. There's a reason I came all the way up. To the human sea. I have a request. Okay. I want this one more jellyfish. Okay, before we go. It almost blew up. Okay, now I'm too heavy to move. I can't even go faster. No dive, Dave. No dive. Well, at least for one thing, though, we got a huge haul of jellyfish work to get back to the restaurant. This is a scooter. I need a scooter. Yes! The scooter. But before that, let's do this thing. Thank you, scooter. Okay. Good thing I upgrade my suit. Oh, I'm getting real scoop spooky vibes. Uh oh. There's another boss. Yeah, there it is. I don't know how to fight it yet, though. Something just moved past me. Human, go on ahead, be on lookout. What's so dark? I feel that there might be something dangerous there. Uh, I'm too heavy for this. Oh, no. I'm too heavy. I can't move fast enough to... Why are you doing this to me? Ah, okay. Since they just did this to me... What weight I am in? 58.2 Fine. Cut two more kilograms so I can go faster. Sure. Look what you just make me do. Throwing away prize loot. I hope this worked though, because I don't know where my where I'm going. Oh, there. Ready for a boss fight. I don't know what this is. Let's hope I'll be safe. Plus, I don't have a gun. <laughs> What's this? Why is there debris like this so deep? Or stay up here. This fish! Mm. Oh no, those vibrations again? Mm. Something has to be here. Why did he tell me to come alone? Here it is! Uh, question. How to kill him though? Only have a hard food. Wolf E. 
What's that? There are wolf eels, I think? I don't think I can run. Oh, whatever. Okay, Audi. Uh, how do you do damage to him? Oh! No, 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 no! Okay, good. Where's he coming from, though? spot on his tail. It looks weaker than the rest of the party. Okay. Okay, that did 50 damage. Okay. 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 I somehow survived, but my, my bike is gonna run out of juice. I'm gonna hang on. Okay, that guy's gonna pop his head. Here it is. Good thing we got an extra weapon crate though. Oh, ouch! Okay, you son of a gun, fish. Just gone. No, phrase that. Rephrase that. Eel is gone. <laughs> uh, how can a wolf eel be so big? Um, <clears throat> I was just about to come and defeat it. I guess I came too late. Aha, uh -huh, you're stronger than I expected, human. Now that you see that big gate over there, that's the entrance to a village. Take the lead, human. But first, let me pick this up. <laughs> now we're gonna take this as food. Uh, I guess it's worth it. Yo, I don't need this. You know I'm heavy though. There's a door. Ooh, we're finally back to the village entrance fashion way. Ramo, you have a key, right? Oh no! I left the key back at the- Just kidding. I have it here in my bag. Oh, I thought you would ask me to take you again. Let's insert the key. Get back to the village. Oh, 
cool. Whoa, so this is... <laughs> that's right. This is a sea people village. To think there will be a place like this under the sea. Huh? Wait, how? How did a human get in here? Oh, Ramu and Zuan. Were you kidnapped by this human? Tenzin await you. He's lost sleep worrying about you. Uh, it's kind of hard to explain. Ha, allow me. I rescued Ramu after she was kidnapped by a squid. Forget it. Just take me to my father. It'll be faster for me to explain things to him. Some affair. Tenzin's house. Oh, there it is. There's the king. <laughs> oh my goodness, Maro, my Ramo, my daughter. Where were you? Your daddy was worried I was with. You heard? Did a human do something to you? Wait, who's this next to you? I thought you brought a blue manatee, but this is a human. What is going on here? I like an explanation. You know that strange things have been happening around here recently, right? For example, the tremors and the ice melting off the divine tree. Of course, Ramo, I've been looking into the causes. It's already been two years. You know our technology has its limit. Well, the ancient texts have all been lost, and we need to figure out new methods again. We can't simply keep waiting. Humans are selfish, but they have good technology. We need their help. No, not the humans. They can't be trusted. They dirtied our home and even hunted our kind to put on display. Your wicked creatures looking to hunt us and steal from us. We can't ally with the likes of. Oh, uh, wait, but there's more tremors. Another huge tremor. Me? Something really bad will happen if we don't do anything. Uh, when I was taken by the giant squid in human water, Napier helped me out. Said he was the one who did that earlier. Start asking him. Not all humans can be bad, can they? I mean, well, even even if I wanted this, the villagers would not agree. Getting help from humans, everyone will find that hard to believe. If this man can gain the village trust, I'll consider your suggestion. The village trust. How does he go about winning that? How about asking around to see what they need? Alright, since today's long trip must have been pretty tiring. Human, come back here tomorrow. You have to listen to the villagers' request. Wait, I didn't even agree yet. How am I supposed to come all the way here? from the sea people chapter 3 is your help then you help my daughter Ram. I suppose it wouldn't be fitting for my people to ignore you even if you're a human use this this sea people mirror once it's saw will let you instantly travel to this village oh is such a thing possible the various disasters has caused us our decline, but our ancestors were a very advanced civilization once. Right now, all we have left is a few of their relics. That in any case, install this in your village. It will allow you to come to the village whenever you need. It will only recognize your face, so only you will be able to use it. It also operates from the light of the divine tree or the sun. So you can only use it during the day. Oh, and I'll give you a village map to use. It'll help you find the villagers. Mm. The 
teleportation device. That's pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. I have to go back to the boat with this mirror for now. I'm back at the boat. And it's nighttime for you too. Wolf eel tail me? Oh. What's this? Octopus weapon charm. The mysterious weapon charm left behind by the octopus. Maybe something cool will happen if it attached to a gun. Extra 15% gun base damage? <laughs> Wrap my day. Ooh. Okay. Uh. Cooking. I need more server crew. Cause I'm not sure I have enough money. I guess I'll ins install the sea people mirror on the mm. boat. You said I should go to the sea people village during di with this during the during day. Right, right, right. <laughs> Sorry, English bad. I should go tomorrow. Oh no. Look at the time. Bancho Sushi must have opened already. I should drop by and check if anything of note happened. Oh, well, I'm here. Mm. Looks like I arrived too late. Mm -hmm. I should do a little cleanup. Hey. <laughs> Oh, huh? Miss Yoshi, what are you doing here? No, that's oh, my work ended just now and I was passing by. I saw the lights were on despite the hour. Mm. Bancho Seeds should home already. Bancho Seeds should have gone home already. Mm -hmm. You look a bit tired recently. Worry he might fall ill. Oh, huh, even so, I'm glad to see him working so hard again, I guess. No. Oh, come to think of it. I heard he once gave up on cooking because of a certain incident. Yes. Back then, I thought he was gone for good. Okay. I wonder what it was about. Him. Well, it's nothing that's secretive. I simply avoided mentioning it. With him present, just in case a sore spot comes. Hmm. I'm thirsty. Can you first give me a glass of beer? I can't. so refreshing as a glass of beer after work. <laughs> it's especially nice to have a view of this sea at night, like this as I drink. Hmm. I'll tell you now a bit about Bancho and why he quit cooking for a while. <laughs> it was 12 years ago. Flashback! This is Dugo Hotel. I worked here 12 years ago. It's a five-star hotel with both tradition and a long history. It looks a bit old, yes, but at the time, the quality of the food and service has been newly improved. Yoshi, do you have a moment? What is it, manager? Well, a troublesome customer left a reservation. You'll know the actress Louise Crawford? She made a reservation at our hotel. was a leading actress with career. Her role as a spy in one of her most famous work, the 40 42nd floor. <laughs> the manager has spent his entire life at the hotel. It was like he was a living embodiment. I heard that uh, Who's Crawford can be very picky, but we're a very high quality hotel with history and tradition on our side. I don't think there'll be any issue if he comes. So there is. Okay, nobody can beat the level of service staff at this hotel. We won many prizes as well. Just one thing. 
You haven't heard about heard the rumors about her, have you? Rumors? Take a look at this. She's famous not only as a chef but a gourmet. That's a blurb she published in a travel magazine recently. It appears to be a description of her travels, but just her bashing on the hotel she stay at. Gloria hotels are best of the best, and yet she wrote such a scathing review. Bringing out the bad does make a person look professional. Her writing is most like this. What do you suggest we do, Yoshi? Should I accept or should I decline? No one likes to accept. I suppose we can't refuse the reservation. Only for the hotel's reputation sake. In that case, we'll have to think of how we serve her. We'll take the reservation, but we'll also need the ways to satisfy her. I suppose you're right. Do you have any ideas, Yoshi? Did she receive reserve a suite? Yes, this is the clean rooms and services to match her taste. We'll treat her as VIP. I'll look into the drinks and amenities she prefers. Place them. Also check the state of the room. And about who? I suppose I have to do that. Thank you. There's no one that can handle such a tricky, tricky customer except you, with your long experience with any VIP. Not more tense than usual. And about meals, we can offer her the buffet for breakfast, but we also need to ready a dinner course. The dinner. Let's go French. We have fantastic French food at our hotel. It's the pride and joy of Dugong Hotel, with the Michelin star head chef at the helm. But. You came at the most inconvenient time. Our head chef is in France on a culinary research trip. The sous chef has taken his place for now, and he cooks wonderfully as well. However, our upcoming customer is a very difficult one. He might be a dark horse. However, one great drawback is that he doesn't consider the preference of his customers. His sole focus is letting people try new flavors. That's what drives his creativity. This time, he won't really serve us. We're dealing with the infamous Louis Crawford after all. There's Young Voucher. Looks like he has an afro. Voucher, are you here? It's Yoshi. What are you doing here? Oh, you're here. That's good. I come to check on the status of the manager's request. Look at all you want. It's just an ordinary Japanese food kitchen. Were you practicing? Oh yes, training means thousands and tens of thousands of attempts. Practice without rest is the only way to produce meaningful results. What do you mean you're relieved? Try and please this picking woman. Draw forward. For me, cooking has always been a battle with myself, not with others. Making perfect food has always been my goal. That won't change no matter who I cook for. I simply use the best ingredients available in the current season 
and the most suitable recipe. Would that be okay with you? Sushi course or kaseki? Never heard about kaseki. of a dish that use shark head. Shark are a very tasty fish. This is the time of year when they go fat, losing the flavor. The meat and the cheeks particularly have a lovely cheese texture, which reminds you of ordinary meat. May I have a word? Ancho! Allow me to introduce myself again. I'm the master chef who works here, Ancho. I'm not much of a speaker, so I've been listening quietly. I find it impossible to maintain my sentence now, however. Now now, Ancho. Miss Luis here is just... It is most definitely my fault, for failing to buy food that satisfies you. Will you not give me a chance to make up for my mistake? What you witnessed today aren't my real skills. I will serve you food that are going to objectively be called good. Pancho, you can't be talking about... All done. After that, Bancho quit his job at the hotel and left. They need, he need to train. It's my belief it wasn't so much of 
the cooking itself as the ingredients and the cooking methods that he researched. Mm. We'll Still, I admire him a little for not belief that he's going on the right path. I suppose it was this stubborn side of him that allowed him to attain his current level of skills. Mm. Working with you now, he even started social media. I feel something has changed about him, and I like it. I think you're good for him. Please continue to get along. <clears throat> I'll do my best to help Boncho focus on the cooking. I guess we're not selling fish today. And that's a wrap. Oh yeah. Oh Dave, you weren't around yesterday, so I was a bit of worried. I couldn't get you get in touch with your VA right radio. I couldn't get in touch with you via radio either. Mm -hmm. I was at the Sea People Village yesterday. You, you what? What happened? Mm. Well, you see. Mm. <laughs> Telling him the story. <laughs> I see. I envy you. I do. What a lucky experience. Mm. I'm not sure how I can help, but it's clear they have problems to deal with. Oh, yeah, yeah. Why don't you go talk with the residents first? I love to go as well, but oh, yeah, yeah. as you said, only one person can use the sea people mirror. What a pity. <laughs> <laughs> what an unexpected turn of events. If you need any of my tools, don't forget to check out the cobra shop. Mm. Yes, I'll have to use the sea people mirror first to visit the village. Bye. You can use the mirror Tenzin gave you to immediately travel to the sea people village. The mirror is solar powered, so it's unable to be used at night. It's party day today. Prepare the right ingredients and make a fortune. Wait, I thought it was tomorrow. Ah. So this whole time it was a misunderstanding. Okay, I guess we're doing this jellyfish party tomorrow. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.